Marvel Studios has big plans for Deadpool 3 and the ending of the film. And according to a brand new alleged leak, the ending of Deadpool 3 will be a direct lead-in into Secret Wars. So from everything we know officially, we are going to be exploring more of the Fox X-Men universe in terms of Deadpool and Wolverine looking to recruit a couple more people while they're being chased by the TVA. Outside of that, we don't know much more, but rumors have suggested we're going to see a lot of the old X-Men crew join or at least have some sort of supporting role slash cameo. And that this film will establish some sort of incursion and that this will lead into the bigger picture. Now we're hearing that the ending of Deadpool 3 is going to be pretty big, aka it ends on a pretty major cliffhanger. From the reports that are out there that I've been able to see and kind of connect the dots, Deadpool and Wolverine will end up semi-stranded in the MCU, not knowing if they can or will be able to get back to their universe. This is due to the fact that their universe will reportedly be destroyed, or at least that's the thought. This will then kind of leave everything in limbo up until we get to Avengers Secret Wars where we find out that that universe was not destroyed. It was essentially just cut off from communication and they couldn't get back to it because they had no means of doing it. They were essentially locked out. And from what we're hearing, this is going to be the doing of Kang in that universe who's reportedly also going to be semi-villainous or be alluded to in Deadpool 3. So what we're hearing is essentially that Deadpool 3, yeah, we're going to learn about the imminent destruction and the incursion event that's happening there due to everything that the Fox X-Men universe has been doing with time manipulation, inconsistencies, all the errors that are in the continuity. And as we heard before, Marvel Studios intends to use all the discrepancies to their advantage to explain that this is all due to Deadpool's time manipulation, Cable's time manipulation, and the weird shenanigans of Days of Future Past. Which, if you really think about it, this all works. It makes sense, and it would honestly be a perfect way to set up everything and explain their own demise. And it's kind of almost like breaking the fourth wall, if you will, by stating, hey, you can keep your own film franchise and continuity in sync, because you didn't know what you were doing, well, that ultimately led to its destruction. Like, you can see what they would be going for here with meta-commentary, and I think it would be quite genius on their part. 